one of the main things that I remember growing up is the fact that there was a lot of issues with electricity. I grew up in Benin, West Africa. My sister and I will study in the dark because the electricity will be gone and that situation will last for days, weeks, months, sometime. So I figured I will study electrical engineering so that I could one day help. I think what was really important in my family, we all started to work young. And I believe that's very important to get into the habit of working to achieve something very early in life. And I think that's what drove me to go to college, Frank. I just wanted to achieve. Neither of my parents went to high school. They went to work after eighth grade. I didn't have any relatives that had actually been to college. It was almost like first generation going to college for me, frankly. I lost both my parents and in Africa being an orphan, is almost like you you are done. Finally, my sister who was here helped me to come to the US to continue. When I came, I didn't speak any English whatsoever. Little by little, I started to gain my confidence. Without that engineering background, and by the way, I still remember my professors and students in my class. I mean, that's who I am. So those experiences at Maryland were hugely important to me, and I want to give other students that advantage too. Winning this scholarship definitely pushed me forward because that put my mind at ease and that allowed me to focus more on school-related matters. Each year I fund students for that year, so I get to know the students. I think it's spectacular that Jerome has made this journey from his country to the University of Maryland. That in itself is a spectacular achievement in life. I like the, the friendship, the camaraderie in engineering, how people work together to achieve the common good. I'm delighted that he has the opportunity to study electrical engineering here at the Clark School. Thanks to him, I'm where I am right now. This is something that has helped me, and there are many, many, many other students like myself. Him helping us is basically making us able to help others later. So by continuing that, he's just broadening our ability to impact future generations. Once in a while they graduate and they tell me what they're doing in life. So it's very rewarding to help students. I'll be getting ready to move to Berkeley because that's where I'll be pursuing my uh, PhD. At the end of the day, I aim to develop technologies that are gonna help people who are less privileged. The engineering degree was immensely valuable, both as Secretary of the Navy and as the Deputy Secretary of Defense, because the military is highly technical. Every single profession is somehow affected by engineering. Engineers are going to literally change the world. I would like to thank the Honorable Gordon England for giving me the opportunity to pursue my studies through this scholarship. There is no doubt about it, when I'm done, I will help out too.